What's going on everybody? My name is Tomas. This is my review of the Synology RT 2600 AC. Before we get into this video, I wanna preface it by saying I've learned with any Synology product, your usage and setup will vary. You're literally only limited by your imagination when it comes to implementing a Synology product into your workflow. The tools Synology provide gives users the ability to do everything they need to do safely and securely. The dual core 1.7 gigahertz processor on the RT2600 AC provide fast, uncompromising performance when working. There's a powerful 4x4 802.11 AC wave system in the router that gives users the ability to get up to 2.53 gigabits of speed over a wired connection. The dual WAN for wireless provides up to two gigabits of throughput with the ability to set load balancing and fallover support. The RT2600 AC comes packaged with Synology's router manager, which lets users take full control over their personal or small business networks. SRM has many powerful add-on packages, which can be loaded from Synology's package center. Some of the add-ons I was most interested in was the VPN plus package, cloud station server, media server, and intrusion prevention. Two of which I covered in my review of Synology's DS916 Plus NAS. Uh, check that video out if you want to learn more about that whole system. In a nutshell, VPN Plus, which is currently in a strong beta status, is the perfect solution for small businesses with multiple offices or employees who work from home. It provides a secure connection to businesses' network resources, ensuring sensitive data remains safe. The RT26 600 AC paired with the VPN Plus gives users the control over their own network and gives the ability to create a powerful VPN server with advanced features. The VPN Plus add-on is a simple to use and easy to set up way to give people a secure, fast access to the data they need when they need it. The comprehensive features include real-time traffic monitoring, past connection history, speed limit, and web filtering, giving users advanced control over all VPN access. And because I'm no VPN master and I'm barely getting into this if you want to learn more about VPN plus hit the link in the description of the video that'll give you a whole write-up and give you everything you need to know about what this package add-on has to offer to you now I know how to safely navigate the internet but people on my network may not with the intrusion prevention add-on package, I can bring an all-encompassing intrusion detection system, or IDS, and intrusion prevention system, IPS, together to protect my network. IDS features active protection of all network devices from malicious parties. IDS analyzes network traffic and detects intrusion within a network, while IPS inspects the network packages to proactively prevent suspicious traffic and network requests from entering a user's network. Finally, IDS gives a comprehensive log and search function with an overview of statistics and accumulated data within SRM, which is extremely easy to use and manage. So now that we've gotten through all that geeky stuff, the RT2600 AC sounds like a great router for businesses and professionals, but is it a good uh, router solution for the regular person that doesn't do any type of remote work or uh, have a personal network? The short answer, it's an emphatic yes. With the RT2600 AC, parents can take full control of their child's internet activity. As SRM gives parents a way to filter web addresses and limit internet access to specific devices. Synology takes development and security seriously, so you are guaranteed to receive updates to SRM, while other manufacturers don't always update their router management software, if they ever do, as some of them are right now uh, really outdated and archaic, not meeting the needs of today's internet. And my final point, the RT2600 AC is a perfect replacement for the Apple Airport system. With the RT2600 AC, users are able to enable Mac file services, making it possible to connect any type of hard drive to the router and use Apple's Time Machine feature with it natively. The RT2600 AC is one of the first and only routers to do that for Macintosh owners. With that said, let's get into testing this thing. Right away, we're gonna talk about some pretty subjective data because it's all depending on your internet service provider. I did some regular tests for internet speed and I did it on all three of the bands with the Synology RT2600 AC because you can switch between 2.4 gigahertz, five gigahertz, and you can also do a combined option with 
this router. So with the 2.4 gigahertz, I was getting around 84 megabits per second download and 22 uh, megabits per second upload. On the five gigahertz band, I got a 105 megabits per second download and a 24 megabits per second upload. The combined, I was getting 160 megabits per second download and a 24 megabits per second upload, which is what I would recommend any user of the RT2600 AC to select and set up their network using. Use the combined uh, auto feature within this router because you will realize faster connections with your ISP. Next, I tested my local area network transfer capabilities because this router allows you to connect hard drives to it, allowing you to create a network attached storage. The test that I conducted was a 1.9 gigabyte ProRes LT file transfer. I wanted to see what kind of speeds the hard drive was getting me being directly connected. It was a 26 second transfer time to move that uh, nearly two gigabyte file. On the 2.4 gigahertz band, it took 323 seconds to complete. So five minutes, 23 seconds to complete that file transfer. On the five gigahertz band, it took 122 seconds for that transfer to finish. And on the combined auto switching within the router, it took one minute and seven seconds or 67 seconds. So again, here comes uh, some supporting data for reasons why you would want to connect this router using the auto combine feature with the networks being uh, switched to automatically on this router. Now the only thing missing from this router is the ability to create some sort of mesh network with it. If there was some sort of add-ons with the RT2600 AC where you could plug them around your house to extend your ability to uh, realize really high performing Wi-Fi, uh, this router would be the perfect solution. I did have some issues with the RT2600 AC uh, connecting when I was on the furthest end of my home. You did see a significant drop in Wi-Fi speeds. You're still going to have difficult reaching those far points in your home without some sort of extender or something uh, implemented within this workflow. So if Synology came up with something to create some sort of mesh network and pair this with the RT2600 AC, again, I say that this, this router and its system would be perfect. Before I get out of here, I wanna make it clear that I by no means covered every fraction of what the RT2600 AC is capable of. SRM really puts the power and control back into the user's hands, so feel free to hit the information I linked in the video Video description. Also, while you're in the video description, pricing and availability will be linked down there as well. Before I close, I must disclose Synology was kind enough to send this router out to me for review. So without them, this video would not have been possible. Well, that about does it for me in this one. If you like this video, please feel free to give me a thumbs up. If not, hit that other one. Thanks for taking the time to watch. I'm Tomas and I'll catch you in the next one.